What's up guys? Uh, this is a water pump. As you can see, it has a seal on it and uh, a lot of times I do uh, water pumps and then I want to make sure I have a security that it's not going to leak. It has a paper seal. So if you got a Jeep, if you got, if you got, if you're putting in a water pump, Toyota Camry, the older models or the new models, if they got a plastic, uh, I'm sorry, the paper gasket, it's bound to leak, okay? Take a look at the surface that I was working on this. So surface, gotta be clean. Surface, gotta meet surface. In between, there's a gasket, there's gotta be a gasket because metal to metal is not a good gasket. So me doing a job like this and uh, it's gonna leak, I'm not gonna be happy. The guy who's paying me $700 is not gonna be happy because he's gonna come back to me. I'm gonna have to reopen the whole timing if it's with timing. I'm gonna have to open up all the engine mounts and belts and everything just to get this to do it again. So there's something, there's a sealer for that. Let me show you guys that. Let me present to you guys with that. Rubber sealer is gonna save your life. And trust me on this one, it's gonna save your life. It's gonna save you time, headache, and money. Anyways, check this out. Okay, so I was working on this pump. I've done so many jobs on these and uh, usually this paper gasket will leak compared to this uh, a water pump or from Honda it has a rubber seal okay that seal works pretty good no sealer is required there but compared to this one um, what I got was uh, this uh, sealer here this is a high tech sealer here so there's a part number on this little guy and uh, 80062 is the part number there so you guys might want to pick this up pretty good stuff so I, I had one of these before laying on here. Where did it go? Right here. Okay, I shouldn't. Ah, it dried up on me. So just to show you guys, this thing is like a it's like a rubber. Okay, it's like a rubber. Okay, it works like a rubber. But all you need to do here is you need to take this little guy. It comes with a brush in there, and uh, you just need to put some all over where your paper seal is gonna sit. And just like that, shouldn't take you too long to do this. And just get small thin layer before you put this onto the vehicle. You don't need to let it dry or anything like that. And the beauty of this is, it's gonna hold your gasket as well, okay? So not just that, you need to, now we're gonna get this let a guy on just like this so this goes like that so we're gonna put another layer on top of this okay we're gonna put another layer on top of this very simple procedure it's gonna hold your gasket as well okay so this stuff is good stuff before you put this water pump on don't worry about being clumsy it's not gonna end of the world it's not gonna damage anything the pump is just gonna smack everything if you get anything on the fin it's just gonna toss it off so this baby goes in just like that Okay, this pump is on my way, but that's fine. Don't miss this spot. That's all I could tell you. Don't miss this spot. The job might look all crazy and lame, but at the end of the day, this baby's gonna save you a day. It's a good saying right there. At the end of the day, this baby's gonna save you a day. So here's a water pump and here's a water pump. This guy doesn't need this, but this guy, you're gonna have to put this stuff on. But anyways, after that, you take this pump, put it onto the vehicle, Tighten up all the bolts and uh, give it a good uh, probably hour or so once it's on tight and everything and it will dry itself so let me just show you guys up close and personal what this looks like okay there you go so this is the sealer that you want to pick up and it will save you a big headache trust me it will save you a big headache it's like a reddish color and uh this is gonna work pretty good. Part number, everything is there for you guys. Anyways, thank you for watching my small little video.